Man, what a view, huh? What you're looking at here is by far the biggest park in Stansbury. It's beautiful, right? You got the walkways, the trees, the grass, seriously. There's like 30 acres of peaceful open space. So, why is there one small corner? And I can just hear the, you know, the thunk, thunk, thunk. In all this open land. But it's the ping, 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 ping. No! With pickleball courts literally just feet away from these holes. Yeah, we were actually the first ones to move in in the final phase. And so we actually saw this place get built. Now that right there is Bryce Monk and says when he built this home nearly a decade ago, the space on the other side of his fence. So it was actually curbed and guttered for a parking lot. Did not have pickleball courts in the plans. But as the sport gained in popularity, so did the requests for courts. They just moved forward very quickly for, the, for these courts to go in. Okay, now I want to pause here for a moment because when Bryce is talking about they, he's actually talking about the Stansbury Service Agency, or the SSA. It is a government agency with six board members making decisions on this and other parks. One of those decisions revealed in this 2020 grant application, showing a map of the neighborhood, you got the park with a circle, and a big fat arrow saying, quote, this area has been reserved for the construction of pickleball courts for several years. It is amazing how loud that really is. But yeah, when you talk so with some of the neighbors, when this went in, it was a complete shocker to us. They say it was never clear. They didn't tell us it was coming in. Of the effects these courts would have on their lives, the sounds, the volume, <laughs> and the repetitive noise. There are no rules. There are many variables to take into consideration. Carl Schmitz is managing director for USA Pickleball and says one of the variables that needs to be taken into account are noise ordinances. For Porterway Park, USA Pickleball says a court should be 100 feet from homes. They look at where they might be located relative to the, the homes nearby and start to just work some calculations. Calculations that were never worked out. The SSA admitting a sound study was never done. So 68.2, 51.7, 67.3. The KSL investigators begin working our own calculations near the neighborhood fence line closest to the courts. 65.2, 65.0, 67.2. In Tooele County, the noise ordinance shows a max of 65 decibels. And with every smack of the paddle, 65.3, 66 flat, 68.1. Most of the readings we got were within that range, give or take a few. But the ordinance also mentions repetitive impulsive noise. I don't know exactly the definition of impulsive, but it seems pretty impulsive to me. It also mentions repetitive. It sounds pretty repetitive to me. The SSA would not talk to us on camera, but did issue a statement saying, before the Porter Way Park courts were built, the idea was discussed in multiple public meetings and a board member even knocked on doors and consulted residents in the neighborhood about the project. No residents expressed concern about the project, end quote. But after the courts were built, it wasn't just the noise. They're horrible, Bright. The biggest thing is, is I can't go to sleep. Interrupting the lives of those nearby. Every night, as the sun begins to set, another issue comes to light. And now we come out and you have this glow over the houses. A glow some of the neighbors say is finding its way into their homes up until 10 o'clock at night. I can't sleep in that bed. <laughs> so we've moved our bedroom downstairs. Because of complaints, the SSA says they have tilted the lights and installed shields to block the lights from nearby homes. And while neighbors say the adjustments have slightly helped, Nobody should have to put up with this. It is clear the overall issue has not been solved. Still, trying to understand with nearly 30 acres of open land. So from this window to that light post is 50 feet. Why? They built the kitchens on these courts within an earshot away of the kitchens in these homes. All right, six, one, two. 